Okay, so this epoxy stuff is somewhere from $75 to $110 a gallon. In other words, it's expensive stuff. I was making the chaos bowl and I wanted to add just a drop of dye to it so it would be translucent. So I'm squeezing the bottle really hard and kaboom, the top pops off and the whole bottle just empties into my epoxy creating a black inky mess. So yeah, I didn't read the bottle, but oh well. I didn't want to waste the epoxy. I made a quick mold out of the remnants of some older molds. Nothing fancy, just some silicone sealant to hold it together to prevent from leaking, and some screws to hold it together. found a piece of black oak laying around, knocked off the bark, and cut up my table saw into smaller pieces. pressed on time, the epoxy would cure on the bucket if I went too slowly. So I just hot glue gunned the wood directly into the mold instead of covering it with the epoxy, which would have sealed it. A few days later, I took it out of the mold. to flatten the bottom a bit and then whack the top protruding wood pieces off on the bandsaw. This left me with a pretty cool bowl blank. Tossed it on the CNC machine using my normal glue and tape hold down technique. Once it was done, I popped it off the MDF and I cracked the bottom. But no problem, super glue to the rescue. And finishing, which was just a food safe cutting oil in this case. Thanks for watching. I'm happy to answer any questions you might have about this bowl or my techniques. I recommend checking out this related video where I'm making a CNC shell bowl out of wood. I document the entire process of how I created this bowl. If you want to download the Fusion 360 file, check out the description and go ahead and download it. Subscribe, like, and comment. It encourages me to make more videos. Thanks everyone. Thank you.